Dear Princess Sunbud, Letter 80. Dear Princess Milady, I met someone new today. He's a donkey, and he's fucking insane. Not the haha look at Twilight trying to steal teeth from the dentist kind of insane. This guy's legit nuts. His name is Don Quixote, pronounced Hote, don't ask me how, and he claims, it seems, to truly believe that he's a knight of Equestria. He wears a bike helmet and carries a broken rake everywhere he goes, trying to fight buildings, and he keeps losing. He even tried to fight the library so he could save the fair maiden from the dragon, and that was the final nail in the insanity coffin, and he thought I was a fair maiden. What a nut job. Anyway, dude's gonna move on to terrorize some other town soon, and that'll hopefully be the last we see of him. Your literary litmus test, Twerp Slurple. From Her Royal Highness Lady, RE Letter 80. Dear Knight Hote, your Princess of the Sun requests your presence in Canterlot at your convenience to discuss your tenure as a Knight of Equestria, and to ensure that all is well within the lands thereof. Journey safe, Sir Knight. Her Royal Highness Celestia. Dear Mending Ways, don't worry, this isn't about Twilight Sparkle. There seems to be a gentle jack by the name of Hote, who believes himself to be a knight of the realm. To my knowledge, I have not knighted any pony, donkey, mule, or otherwise in the past several years, and I do not recognize the name as it is not even remotely familiar, with a grand total of two donkey knights from whom I believe would still be alive today. I would like to request your availability in the near future to assess this Jack for his mental health and whether or not he is a danger to himself or others. I would prefer to do so without upsetting him, and see no harm in playing along. Pen by Her Royal Highness Celestia. P.S. I do so hope you've been recovering from your phobia of the color purple. To my most faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. To be perfectly fair, Twilight, the craziest being to have ever legitimately claimed the title Knight of Equestria was Sir Tally IV. Sir Tally had a rather nasty habit of running off before I could finish assigning him a mission, and caused no less than eight diplomatic incidents, the raising of a cabbage farm, and single hoofly won a war that was brewing with a small diamond dog enclave. Admittedly, those are just the exploits history records, at least in books I have read mentioning him, but he once successfully delivered a bouquet of orchards to me as an ode to my beauty. No, I did not misspell orchids, he had actually managed to cut down a total of 40 fruit-bearing trees and shrank them to the size of a bouquet of flowers. I don't know how, because Sir Tally was an earth pony, and that was on his first day of duty. I drank more alcohol during his lifetime than any other period of my life. Your loving mentor, Princess Celestia. P.S. I realize he still doesn't sound quite as insane as a donkey engaging in battle against a building, but that's mostly because I don't want to give any pony any ideas. Things are getting more and more insane as we go. Then again, that was from the start. Anyway, I'd like to give a very special thank you to my snazzy donators. Yoshi Super Saiyan 2, Peter Coltard, Nicholas Springthorpe, Dospo, Rainbow Dash 1990, Rune 9852, David D. Sanchez, Dwight Cornell, Gaggy, Secret Moon, Orion Pax Kaiju, Starlight Glimmer, Trey, Pokey Killer Zack, Soul Dragon, Zack Britton, Joe Pierce E, and Reno. Thank you all very much for watching this video, and I'll see you all in the next one.